So this question is a slam and leaf uh, diagram. So, which means um, the key is here for the stem and leaf. Okay, so one stroke three means thirty one for mathematics. Okay, okay, meaning this thirty one is represented by this. Are you clear? Let me use a different color. Okay, and then this thirty two is represented by. 3 stroke 2. Can you see that? Okay. So, what you are actually. Uh, what I have done here is I extract this out. This means 31. Okay. And then this part is 32 for signs. Are you clear? Are you clear? The key is important. The key is to tell you how you read. Understand? Without the key, nobody knows how to read. So now let's redo this one. So what you what you get? Let's check it out. One stroke one zero. So maths science. So What's the score for math? How you read? One. Okay. Huh? One stroke one. One so, yeah. So basically you read this one, right? Yeah. How do you read? you read from the left to the right or right to the left? Right to the left. Remember, huh? you say right to the left. Huh? Why right to the left? For, for this is right to the left because can you see? It's 3, 1, right? That's why it's 31, right? Can you see that? Right? So it's right to left for the math scope. And what about signs? For signs is? Yep. Left to right for signs. So subsequently, you extract it out, you should read it like this. Are you clear? Are you clear? So math is. 11 science is 10 good so you're done with this this tree gone meaning you have read this already you can like slash it to tell yourself okay i have recorded it i don't need them anymore so now next one five one two how do you read five one two so it's five one two so what's the math score very good then size very good okay good quick real quick the rest seven one three so five is gone two is gone so it's seven one three so how uh, yep uh, very good so i think so on and so forth but you just need to be careful don't read wrongly you know okay that means you so whatever you have done right can you just slash it out so that you say oh i'm done with those i don't need to read those so i need to focus on the rest so it's continue you have 18 then uh 18 and 18 right then you stroke it good so you have 19 so you should be reading this and then you have 18 here this is that means done for the first row for mathematics but you're not done for the First rule for science, right? Can you see? You see after? Over here, you're done already. Can you see? But over here, you, you're not done, right? You still have the what? One nine, which is 19 for the science. Good. Okay, so that means you're done with the first rule. Both science and mathematics. That's that? So you will continue to do the same thing for the second row and the third row. Are you clear? So if you are fast enough, I'm going to speed up very fast. Uh, so, okay, how I quickly do it is, usually how I do it is, I will do the mathematics first. Okay, so I will do this. So I'm continuing with the mathematics. This is what? Zero two means? Very good. Then, 
on. 1, 2 is? Very good. 2, 2? Very good. So it's 23. Keep reading. 25. So on and so forth, right? Okay. So for this question, after you extract all the science scores and uh, math score out, right? Okay. Your job is to find the mean mark for the math. You know what's the meaning of mean? You know what's the meaning of mean? Mean is in mathematics. What was the English meaning of mean? Any idea? Average. How do you find the average? Yep. Uh, total. How do you find the total? Add, Add what? Everything up. Wait, wait, wait. They want the mean for math, right? They want the mean for math. So you should add the what up? So, mathematics. mathematics one. So that means 11 plus 15 plus blah, blah, blah. So the first thing is you need to extract all this out, right? Then you add all this up and divide by how many students here? You need to read how many students. How many students are there? It depends how many number you have, right? Right? So over here, how you read is, okay, the first student is 11, the second student is 20, 15, the third student is 17, so on and so forth. Okay? So what you need to do is you sum up the, the you sum up the 11 plus 15 plus 17 plus until, da -da -da -da, until so you need to extract all these numbers out for mathematics, then add it, add them up, then divide by the numbers of numbers. So you count how many numbers are there. Okay, so there is a very quick way for you to count the numbers of numbers for mathematics. So you just focus on this side. Count how many? One, two, three, four, five. Five for the first row for mathematics. How many for the second row? Eleven. Third row, same thing, 11. You can count. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. So you have 5 for the first row for mathematics, 11 for the second row, 11 for the... So this is the first row, this is the second row, this is the third row. I'm talking about mathematics. Huh? Don't, don't, don't focus on the science first. We'll do science later on. But the same strategy. So you have 5, 11, 11. Total up is 27, right? Am I right? Right? So you divide by 27. Then you will get the average. And in mathematics, mean means average. Are you clear? That's how you read the stem and leave. Alright? So if the question asks for science, you do the same thing. But if they ask for the science, you focus on which one? The right hand side, right? Yeah. yeah. So start from the stem. Okay, this, this, this one is called the stem. The one in the middle is called the stem. Then to the right hand side is the leaf. To the left hand side is the leaf. That's that? So same thing, you count the number of students for science if they ask for. So you have 2, 4, 6, 6. 2, 4, 6, it's 11, 45. 8, 10. Then if this is 10, this one will be 11. Because it's one more than above, right? So if you add up, 27 students for science also. Are you clear? So how do you find the mean for the science score? Add up all this, which is all here, right? 10 plus 12 plus 13, understand? Until the last number, then divide by 27. Okay? So what are the two key what are the two key ideas in stem and leaf is first you must be able to read the key correctly. Either left or left to right or right to left. Okay? Read from the key. Okay, I cannot tell you you must read from the left to the right or right to the left. It really depends on what the key says. You understand? It's all about the key. You understand? Different stem and leaf diagram have different keys. Alright? So once you read the key, then extract the numbers out, then divide by the number of students. Are you clear? Oh, that's how you read the stem and leaf.